Capsula Mundi is a project aimed at creating memory forests rather than regular graveyards. Before burial, the deceased is placed in a fetal position in a biodegradable pod. The pod is then buried with a tree seed of your choice. We only recently have decided to start with the production of, uh, of the capsula in a small size for ashes. And uh, we will go for a while also uh, to develop the capsula, the big capsula for bodies. Surprisingly, memory forests are not new to South Africa. In fact, since the 1880s, before the invention of mortuaries and refrigerators, people were buried with blue gum tree branches. Beneath this area lies over 12,000 graves. 127 years ago, the Bramfontine Cemetery was a dense forest of blue gum memory trees. But as time passed, many of the trees were cut down. The smell of the blue gum actually masked the smell of a decomposing body. You must remember that the bodies in those days, there was hardly any refrigeration and had to be buried within about 48 hours. The city of Joburg has recently revived this old practice, encouraging the use of indigenous trees. It plans to open a new ecological cemetery just outside Soweto later this year. With this method, the body will be buried with a microchip or GPS tracking system to ensure that families are able to locate the grave sites of their loved ones within the memory forest. Narissa Subramani, Johannesburg.